possibly a bit selfish of me to say this. Carmen, oh my god, you're being such a brat right now. And how so, Jess? Why the hell did you leave Daryl? You only been married seven months. I know, I know, Jess. You don't have to keep rubbing that little fact in my face like everyone else. <laughs> Come on, don't you think this is even in the slightest bit fucked up? You know, I just wish I didn't let people talk me into getting married so soon, all right? I had plans after college. Travel the world, live in a different city. Other, other than the one I freaking grew up in. And you can still do all of that with your husband. It's not the same. I never had the chance to live a little like you did. Look, I can totally empathize with not having the chance to experience variety before settling down with just one person. But do you know how hard it is being single? Going on multiple dates with shithead after shithead. Just to find one guy who starts off cool, but eventually turns out to be just another shithead? And that's what I'm saying, Jess. At least you've had the chance to experience that. You know what I did for spring break while everyone else headed to Cancun? Every year, I got to hang out with Daryl's family in the Hamptons. I remember when he first told me, he was like, Hey, we're going to hang out with my parents in the Hamptons. And I was like, the Hamptons? What the fuck is that? Do you mean like Hampton in his sweep? I said it jokingly because I hoped to hmm. fly. He didn't mean, let's Shut it. on the plane and fly to New York. Which unfortunately he did. Which is in the exact opposite direction of any beach I care about. And wow, Daryl's family, some of the nicest people you will ever meet, but oh my god, they are so boring. His kid brother apparently has some sort of programming whiz, and he kept going, hey Carmen, hey Carmen. Where's the chip? Chip? What chip? I don't know what you're talking about, you crazy bitch. Now let me go. Do you get hungry? Are you expecting to have some food at some point today during all of this? <sighs> you look cute with your hair down. Want to watch me invert a binary tree? And after about a day of hearing that shit, I so wanted to be like, Hey, Jeffrey, want to watch me invert your face? I can't believe you right now, Carmen. Do you know how many women would kill to be in your place? Daryl's family is loaded. Have you even had to work at a day job? Uh, I might want a job. Carmen, Charlie in the Chocolate Factory, you found the golden ticket. And you're complaining? <sighs> hmm. The one with the hot stones again, please. Right away, man. What? Oh, not you, Jess. Look, I just want to relax and not have to think about all this for a bit. Are you talking to me again? Uh, yes. I was just saying that I just wanted to be left alone for a bit. I know, it's kind of messed up. And possibly a bit selfish of me to say this, but... If I'm being completely honest with myself in this moment, I would have to say that this is the most relaxed that I've been in months. <laughs> I mean, most days I haven't gotten out of bed until 10 a.m. No yoga, no feeding the dog, no picking up after the dog, no running into my neighbors while on walks and pretending to be interested in their boring lives. Look, Carmen, just go home to your husband or I'm going to come there and kick your ass, all right? Just pick up the phone and tell him you fucked up. Just where the heck are you anyway? You'd better not be with Connor. Jesus, Carmen, what the fuck? Look, I'll think about it, all right? And just where are you headed to again? Since I'm being interrogated. Costa Rica. What? 
Want me to come and meet you? Carmen, I want you to go home. Ugh. Besides, it's just Donna, Ronnie, and Skate. Ew, you still hang out with those losers? Ugh, that was like so high school. Come on, they're not that bad. Donna found Jesus. What? Jesus can't save that bitch? It is much too late for that snooty skank. Not only will she bathe in a lake of fire, but Satan will hold her fucking head under it. Aww. Do you honestly believe you're gonna have a good time with those guys? It's gonna be a fucking blast.